Yeah, I'll put it down. How's that? Hello, friends! My name is Brad Dayton. I'm your humble narrator. Welcome back to Firewatch. I'm supposed to be heading up into this watchtower. It seems like there's some red lights blinking up there. Which might be a good sign or not. It doesn't smell like fire. And that's uh, supposed to be my job, apparently. My wife is sick in the hospital, so I'm gonna go live in the woods. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye. I'll see you in hell. Hmm. I thought these were like holes in the floor, but I guess the, the shack ain't as bad as I thought. Yeah. I have yet to pass my judgment on the gameplay. Let's open this door up. Turn on the power. What was the blinking red light? This? Generator switch. Bam. Hello, home. Hello, Two Forks Tower. Oh, what? Talking to me? Hey, what you doing? Is somebody there? Hold left shift to activate radio. Uh, hello? Release left shift to talk. Okay. Um, hello? Whoever this is? It's Henry, right? Yeah. I'm Delilah. Yeah, that's what the guy said on the phone. So, what's wrong with you? Excuse me? <laughs> People take this job to get away from something. So, what's wrong? What's wrong with you? That's a great idea. Go ahead. Look, I just hiked for two days, so I don't really follow whatever it is you're doing right now. You take a stab at what's wrong with me. Fine, then can I... What, sleep? Forever? Sure, buddy. Okay, now go ahead. Um, let's see. Nobody back home likes you. Seems like a bitch, doesn't she? Already, I've, I've spoken three sentences to you. You're either weird or ex an extreme bitch. That's, that's my guess. Okay, you're probably out here because nobody back home can stand you. Which, after this brief introduction, is not a big shock. <laughs> Ouch. Uh, I'll chalk that up to you being tired and grumpy. Well, I'd grumpy. better get some sleep then. One sec. Now it's my turn. Okay, God. good night. Bye. Let's see. I don't know anything about you. But nine times out of ten, folks out here simply got dumped. Huh, is that it? Close? Good night. <laughs> good night. Welcome to the job. It's a lame intro. I only like, they're like, hey, look at all these likable characters. Aren't they quirky? And I'm like, no, not really. Everybody just seems like an asshole. Good morning, Henry. Well, I guess good afternoon. <laughs> you probably slept like a rock. Anyway, uh, there's still a few hours of daylight to get some work in. I can see you at your desk, so call me when you're ready. I don't want to. I want to write on my paper some more. I'm busy. Leave me alone. Well, they keep sticking me in these situations where there's like, there's only one thing you can interact with. You're sitting in your desk. You can't get up or anything. I wonder what happens if I just sit here for 15 minutes and stare out the window. Don't you understand? I'm dead inside. But then the other half of me says, you know, I got a job to do. I should probably just do the job. She's probably looking at me, wondering what I'm thinking right now. Well, you ain't gonna know, unless you watch this YouTube video. Alright, give me this shit. Oh! Yeah, I slept in. What do you want? Hey, sorry. Guess I slept in. You got a relaxing, what, 14 hours of sleep? Woo. Yeah, Jesus. I guess it's, what, 6? Six? 6.45. Whoops. Don't worry about it. That hike puts everyone out of commission for a day or two. But now that you're up, let me quickly get you acquainted with the job. There's a thing in the middle of your room with a round map on it. Do you see it? Yeah, look at that. Okay, yeah, I see it. This is the Osborne Firefinder, invented in 1914 by W.B. McCurney. Osborne? You oh. use this to spot, you guessed it, fi- What the fuck? What is it? Nothing. Um, you, uh, you use this to- Oh, fuck me! Good God, language, lady. Well, look at that. your west-facing window. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? See it. I see it indeed. Whoa, that's not legal, right? Uh, no. You need to get down there right now and stop them. Fire danger is through the fucking roof. Is that really my job? 
Your job is whatever I say it is. Look, the closest ranger is like two days away. Go down there and set him straight. Set him straight. Like, kick the shit out of him? Like, kick the shit out of him, sort of straight? <laughs> no, 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 no. Jesus, no. What? I'm not a cop. It's not like I've got a rule book over here. Just make sure they don't do it again. Take their shit. All right, fine. Don't feed anyone a knuckle sandwich. Get going. You'll probably need a rope to get down the shale between you and the lake, if I remember right. A there rope. should be one in the supply box on the way. The code is one, two, three, four. It's wow. actually that for all of them. Extreme security. One, two, three, four. Yeah. Secure. Secure. Shut up. Shut up. You shut up. Your job's whatever I say it is. Go find these firefighting people. Oh no, wait, I'm the firefighting people. I gotta find the, the fireworks people. The fire making people. See? That's their job. We all have our own jobs. So, uh, how am I supposed to keep myself oriented? Okay. We do have a map. Isn't that wonderful? And even a crumpus. That's wonderful. Zoom in. What the fuck? 306. So I guess I just gotta follow this trail, eh? Lower the map. Can I, like, run or anything? Nope. Walking simulator, just like I said. You guys like walking? Do you guys like simulators? Check out Firewatch! It's $20. What the fuck? Yep, three to four hours you can walk around in the woods. That sounds terrible. <laughs> that sounds like I would hate that. Well, it's not as far as it looks, I guess. Either that or we're fucking amazing, amazingly fast. We're like a 12-foot tall man or something. Which really, you can't really tell. When I was going down the stairs, I did grab the, the top so I didn't uh, bonk my head. So I might be a 12-foot tall man. That lady said she could see me at my desk. Which, I don't know how that would happen, you know. Unless I was a 12-foot tall man, so we're just going to go with that for now. Um, open. I have to radio in. I found the box. Found the supply box. Great. Great. Okay. Um, are there a lot of these so are there or what? A lot of these out in the woods. Yeah, we got them all over the Shoshone. They saved us a lot of back and forth from the trailhead. Don't take all the good stuff. Yeah, all right. The good stuff. That's the good stuff. So, one, two, three, four, open! Shit. Fuck, what's up? <coughs> Whoopsie. Okay, we're good now. There's a pine cone, a granola bar, and an old rope. I'm just gonna take the granola bar. Drop, examine, or eat? Can I put it in my bag? Fine cherry and almond granola bar. It's not really good or anything, it's just fine. It's fine! It's not fucking fine. Hair is fine! Alright, so, uh, copy information? That sounds like a good idea. Map updated, hooray! Ron, hey man. Guy couldn't take it, so I locked up his lookout and some stuff in the box. Found one of those old bars he liked. Hiking into the park, but let's get fucked when I'm back. Get fucked. Get fucked, matey. That's what I'm talking about. Alright, so I got my stupid little rope. I got my uh, information that I don't understand from the map. And I know that Mike and Dave want to fuck each other. Mike and Dave need need wedding dates. Oh, R to toggle jogging. Thank God. Jesus. Thought I was just going to be strolling through the woods forever. You know, it's like a Pokemon game where you got to wait to get the running shoes or whatever. They don't just want to tell you right off the bat. Lest you miss the amazing wonder around yourself. Which I'm... I'm not super amazed by this game. It is pretty, I'll say that much, but aside from that, meh, especially with that price point. Oh boy, oh boy, I don't want to talk about it. Alright, 
Let's get ready. Do some climbing. We'll rappel down this thing. I know it's repel. Oh, look, I can see my legs. Damn, I never check if I can see my leg in the games. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I ate shit. Good thing I don't have a health bar. Everything's fine. We're cool. And I'm still wearing my wedding ring. Hmm. Record climbing accident? I'm fine. I didn't fucking die or anything. We're good. Don't worry about it. Stop telling me what to do every step of the way, game. That's why games have gone to shit, game. Just let me do what I want. Let me do what I want, damn it. Report meadow, report climbing accident. Yo, dumb as hell. Where's the fireworks? I'm not very good at this mountain man type shit. Hmm. Where do I look? I'm staring at the big outcropping down here, but I'm not quite sure where to look for our uh, pyrotechnicians. Hmm. Maybe keep heading west toward the lake. Hmm. Is that sarcasm? Because I don't deal well with sarcasm. Beer can. Hmm. Drop. You know what? Fuck it. I'm not the maid. Fuck it. I'm not the maid. That's what I'm talking about. Every once in a while, I, I kind of agree with this dude. Backpacks. Can I ruffle through their... Rifle through their backpacks? Not ruffle. Stomp out the campfire. The fuck are you guys doing out here, huh? Ooh, whiskey. Oh, shit. Ferret or Irish. Yeah, I'm saving this. Very nice. And bundle of fireworks. I'm taking these, too. Whiskey and fireworks. It's all for me. Beer cans everywhere. I tell you what. Hey, there's clothes. I should take the clothes and just fucking throw them into the woods. Oh, you gotta march out naked? That's too fucking bad. Guess you shouldn't have been a little shit. There's a bra. A bra hanging up on the trees. A pair of panties. Let's examine them. Oh. That's a, that's a good year. <laughs> I hear music. Hello? What is this? You guys having a good old time, are ya? Found them. In the lake, naked. Skinny dipping. Yeah. Is that a guy over there? Yeah, hey. <laughs> Enjoy dealing with that. Alright, well, uh... I know how to stop this music. Well, hey, put that down. Yeah, I'll put it down. Seriously, it was a cute... How's that? Another firework, and it won't be your stereo Iraq. Oh, fuck you, psycho. Yeah, fuck you. Yo, fucking so dangerous. fucking edgy. You can't just harass girls in the woods. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. That's all I wanted. Stupid skanks. The fuck are you doing out here? Hey, friend, let's get naked and go in the hey, lake together. Uh, I'm good. It's done. Well, that's ominous. <laughs> Hopefully there won't be any more trouble. Good. Thanks for going down there. <laughs> going down there. Get it? Get it? It's a joke about cunnilingus. Never mind. Alright. Let's get back to uh, our little... Our little spot. We take a little nappy nap. The lady said I slept for uh, 16 hours, and it's 6, so I think it's 6 p.m. That makes a little sense to me. But I don't know where I am, or what I'm doing. I just throw some lady's uh, boombox in the water. That's completely normal. Don't worry. If you ever see a boombox near a lake, just throw it in. You won't electrocute anybody. So Probably. Might be more fun if you make. did. What? What? Why do you keep talking to me? I have nothing to say. Anyway, let me know when you get back to your lookout. Yeah, how about that? I have a bit of a confession to make. Why? Why why you gotta tell me this shit? It's my first day on the job. What are we supposed to be friends or something? I'm just trying to do work out here. Forget about my problems. I got a crazy wife and a dead dog. Alright. I'm channeling uh Nick from New Vegas a little bit. 
Oh, there's a storm. Yeah, she probably sees the storm. I'm not gonna check in every fucking five seconds. Hey this, hey that. Hey, I crap my pants. Hey, there's a rock. I see some grass too. Wow, fascinating. And uh, that's about the level of conversation that we're at. Isn't it? Oh look, here's another box. Another box. One. Two. Why do they have all the fucking same combination? That's dumb. That's stupid. Copy some information? Sure. I don't know what it does, but I'll take it. Danger, bravery, the great outdoors. Defend our frontier. A horn? That's kind of cool. Let's examine it. Wow. Look at that. Gorgeous. Isn't it gorgeous? Take this flashlight, though. Ah, is it dead? Oh, no, it's not. Cool! I got a flashlight. I should probably close this. Shit's gonna fill up with water. Hey, we're in the cave now. The flashlight, it does nothing. The goggles, they do nothing. Can I climb this? Sure can. Yeah, it's like that uh, Make a Man Out of You Mulan song. That's what's going through my head. Let's get down to business to harass some kids. They think they can drink whiskey and they'll find out I'm pissed. I'm tired of climbing up these rocks, somebody shining lights on me. I don't know why this is, but I'll find out. It didn't rhyme. It didn't rhyme. Jump. Oh man. Games like this are just rough on me. You know that? <laughs> I, I don't particularly enjoy being handheld every step of the way. They're like, you can't jump unless you're right here. You can't go off the path. Please follow our instructions. The only wiggle room that I have is not fucking reporting everything on the radio. I'm talking to this chick who, like, who thinks she's edgy or something. You got a dead wife. Or, not a dead wife, but uh, a crazy wife. And if you're still wearing the wedding ring, then guess what? Don't be making friendly with other chicks. The fuck is that? Oh, don't worry, it's just my work partner. Yeah, is it? Is it really? It's not going to end the way you think it's going to end, friend. Oh, I fall down. Damn it. Are you going to cry? You're going to be like, hey, Delilah, I, I fall down. Feel bad for me. Generator's humming away. That's good. Anyways, friends, this has been Firewatch. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. Holy shit. Something's gone upstairs. Why this? Somebody throw my typewriter. It was probably those fucking kids. God damn it. We're going to chase them down in the next episode and beat the snot out of them. <laughs> Anyways, please don't forget to like, comment, and or subscribe if you did enjoy the episode. Ah, we got some, some business that needs doing. Join us for the next one when uh, we chase down some kids and murder them. We've also got links in the description to Twitter, Discord, Patreon, and support. I'd appreciate if you support me on any of those. It's massively appreciated. I'll see you in the next one, friends. Once again, this has been Firewatch. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. And I shall see you then, friends. So until then, bye bye One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.